guys, how are you doing? Second up, can you like not hit me? Oh, I will. <laughs> <laughs> I was waving. You stood in front of me. That was completely your fault, not mine. Completely my fault, of course it was. So, we're back for Tech It, second episode, we only recorded it like two days ago. Um, the second one, the first episode only went up yesterday, and people seem to be really enjoying it. We've had name ideas, we've had Snowden Island, and Bitch Island. Now, <laughs> <laughs> I, I kind of like the name of Snowden Island, but I'm thinking we just wait a little bit for other names to come in. Because the video did only go live yesterday. So if you've got any good name ideas for this really cool island, put it in the description and in the description in the comments. And, you know, best name has their own plaque. Um, also, I realized while editing the last video that we got a load of string from the abandoned mineshaft. So we can make Ooh. a bed. <laughs> oh my god, that is We can make true. a bed. It's also nighttime now. Um, off camera? I don't know why I'm making crafting table we don't need a crafting table um <laughs> so off camera i will show you this really quickly do you want that bed yes okay you have that one i'll, I'll put my <laughs> bed here I'll put my bed here so off camera i macerated a handful of ores mostly because i was bored last night um, i macerated some ores and smelted them in the electric furnace and put them in the project table we have a handful more ores. i didn't macerate all of the ores just some, just to like help us do some crafting. Um, because it is pretty boring and does take some time. Because we don't have any overclockers in here. So that's another thing that we can do. Maybe not today, because me and Sean are both really burnt out from making them. Um, overclocker upgrades, it's pretty simple to make. Coolant cells are just extracting a water cell. Um, and they basically, when you put them in the machine, they draw a little bit more power but they macerate, well they do their job a lot quicker. So they're definitely worth making and they also stack. You can make loads of them as long as you've got the power for it. But I macerated some stuff and we can use that today. Um, also, Sean hasn't seen this yet, but if you come outside. No. Oh, I've also yeah. made the Tato Do Board, but that's not pronounced like that. It's Tato Do Board. 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 Who's the Tato Do Board? Should I read these out then? You go for it. Okay, cool. So we have find food or die. You know, we are hungry. We are, we are hungry. I mean, I've got <clears> to <throat> do kind of hunger bars. Yeah, I, I got a little bit of bread last night after doing the board. I was like, yeah, I'm just going to harvest some wheat. And we've got right. like two extra pieces of bread, that's but that's not really going to last long. <laughs> Okay. Um, clean energy, uwu. Sure. Don't ask why it's an uwu. I do not know. <laughs> so that that would uh, solar, solar, solar. That panels? would be solar power, solar panels, wind turbines, whatever. Just something clean. Okay. Clean because we. We're just using we, coal right now. <laughs> yeah, we, we. That's that's not a good thing. Don't use coal. Coal, coal, bad for for, for trees and that. Mine <laughs> diamonds. <laughs> Do you want to oh, sing that? Like moons. Do you want to sing that? Um, do I want to sing that? Um, no, not really. I woke up like half an hour ago. I'd rather <laughs> not reach to that level. It's 2.30pm. Uh, Next on the list. Okay, we can cross that out because we have a bed now. Oh, okay. That's fair. We need wool, um, but we kind of had that. That's fair. Um, ceiling or roof? I don't care. We, we just um, need something on the house. <laughs> it's quite cold true. in there. Next. We go, we, we're going to... Let <laughs> me <laughs> <laughs> just stop. There's a spider glitching on the tree over there. It's fun to you at home. See, it's, oh, watching it's, it's, up planning, there. it's planning to jump into our house later on. Um, destroy shit with <laughs> dust. Death, death. I, can't I couldn't read. fit destruction death catalyst. catalyst. Yeah, which is pretty cool. Um, anyway, next on the list, source of rubber, because we only have this one rubber tree, which we've not even cut down yet. It's just sort of sat we there. We just have the one tree. This is the it's only one cool. on the island. Oh, it does grow back. Wait, no. Is this rubber here for you? Yeah, it's rubber there. Oh my god, okay, so that's Pog. Um, that is very Pog, because we don't have a tree tap. We don't have a tree tap. There might be one in the chest. I think there's one in the chest, yeah, I did have one on me. For some reason, I really just prefer walking. 
in Tekkit. It just really? feels right to just walk around instead of sprint. I, I think it's why. because there's no sprint key. You have to double tap W. <laughs> I know, but like, I mean, I, I know it's available to me that I can sprint, but I just, it's just, it just feels more comfortable walking around instead of okay. sprinting everywhere, I guess. Um, <laughs> That's not a song. Quite... I just felt like putting a load of A's after it. I know, but you expect so much of me. Industrial area! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Uh, and then give Ireland a good name, which we've already discussed before. About, yeah, because um, Penn Island is not a good name. Yeah, we need to <laughs> better name ideas than that. So again, to comment more name ideas, and again, your 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 name will be um, inscribed, etched we'll in like, gold, solid we'll gold. Like get a plane to fly ahead, leaving like a cloud trail of like your name. Oh yeah, we'll do that. So what should we aim to do then first? So, I'm thinking, like, how much is it for solar panels? Let me have a quick look at the recipe again. So, generator, which we already have one of, but with just one solar panel, it's not really enough energy. So, we might as well keep the one generator we have for the time being. So, we could make... Oops. <laughs> Listen, I was in a testing world. Can you get rid of those? Actually, did I? Actually, no, I already did that. Listen, I forget. How do you change that again? Um, um, go to options and then... Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. No, yeah. I was mode. I was testing the world yeah. before. So it is very easy to accidentally give yourself stuff. Like you can just put yourself in cheat mode and just click. But deleting, you just drag it away and it's gone forever. Um, so we could do a coal dust, some electronic circuits, a generator. Like, we could probably do that now. We just need the rubber. Rubber is our problem at the moment. Excuse me. <laughs> the bottleneck is rubber. So... I think the doll works. Wait, hang on, let me just test it again. I think it's good. Okay, so seeing as we have rubber wood, we can extract that into rubber. So for that we need an extractor, which is... that's the wrong one, we need this one. So we need an electronic circuit, some tree taps and machine block. That is easy. We just need some wood to make the tree taps. And um, we could use rubber wood, but you only get three planks from rubber wood instead of four. I'm tempted to go mining. Should I go mining? Um, if you want to go mining, you can. We could do with the ores. Make sure you don't die and lose all your stuff like I did. <laughs> um, I'm not you, so I'm sure I'll be fine. I mean, what I find funny, not really funny, a bit annoying, is how when I edited that video, I realized how easily I could have found my death point. So with this mini-map, you can set waypoints and stuff, right, by pressing period or full stop, whatever. Press waypoint, um, set a waypoint, I'm going to call it just island, because we haven't got a name for the island yet. And it will be on the map now. It's like the little blue diamond you see on the map. It's really hard to see, but it is there. There's also an option in here to show the actual marker itself. That would have included the death points. <laughs> Which I didn't think of doing. I only looked to the map and saw the location, but not the height. You silly Billy. Yeah, so I could have turned those on and go went straight to them, but I didn't think to do that. There's also a rubber sapling here, so we now have two rubber trees. Yay! I'm gonna put it like somewhere like really annoying. Annoying. No, what? I was gonna put it on top of a hill, so it'd be more out of the way, but I couldn't be bothered to go up there. <laughs> Your attempt to be annoying was just down to I'm not that good you're better at being annoying <laughs> you're like a trained I'm... annoyance I know professional I mean <laughs> I've I've been practicing for years I found diamonds sorry oh my god you found diamonds I was just about to tell chat that we now have an extractor which I'll oh show them how to use but diamonds cool we haven't got any okay so extractors we can throw in like five pieces of rubber wood and I'll turn that into five rubber they're in six we can make copper cables with it you use rubber so much because with machines you're always using copper cables whether it's for the circuits for the wiring or other tools they use them all the time so rubber is something you need a lot of libby needs to bathe as she is a stinker look it was required on the list it's been annoying me for the past few days you've just been a little stinky um 
So I think you taking the bath would be um, good. I'm sorry, it's it, I know it's rude, but it's been annoying me for the past few days, and it, it, it's it's getting. So clean energy. So I guess we could work on a bat box for starters, which is simple. It's RE batteries and a copper cable. That's really cheap. But we also need a solar panel. So we could work on that now. Um, so we'll need how many copper cables? We'll need 12 copper cables, I'm pretty sure. So we could do that. So we want to make more copper cables like that. We'll need more because we need 12. So I'll wait for all this to extract, make a few more copper cables, then we'll need refined iron and redstone. So we need, yeah, two electronic circuits, some glass and coal dust. Coal dust we get by macerating coal. We don't have much coal, because I've put about a stack of coal into the generator to macerate everything. We need more fuel. That's not coal. We need better power, because it's really not viable. Have we got any sand? We've got two pieces of sand. I'll get more sand because we need to finish the windows anyway. There's also oil over there. You can't really see it, but if I look to the left, you can see oil. Now, oil, I've never really used it as a fuel source before. It's also not very clean, believe it or not, but it could be good. You can use it to power engines, which we can use for quarries and things. And then it's usually a fairly good fuel source, but it does not last long. So maybe we can just not use oil. Normally, I just use solar powers. Uh, so I can't talk today. Solar panels. <laughs> I really can't talk today. I've also been struggling. It's fine. Ah! <laughs> First death of the episode. Um, it came out of nowhere. I, I was fighting oh, right by the notice board. It didn't actually. Did it? Okay, I thought my stuff despawned. It wasn't actually there. Okay. <laughs> No, there was a spider underneath the to-do list, to-do board thing, um, yeah. I killed it, and there was a creeper, came up behind me. <laughs> well, now you know my pain, my pick broke, so I'm gonna return. God, what is with this place and creeper holes, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm gonna make the solar panels, so we need the rubber here, copper cables, and we're gonna have 12. So we can do it like this, refined iron, redstone, two electronic circuits. We also need a generator, I'm pretty sure, which is an iron furnace with refined iron and an RE battery. Or the cheaper way of doing it is a furnace and a machine block, because that's just cheaper overall. But we need more refined iron, so we've used quite a bit. So we can just throw that in the electric furnace. So your furnace. We'll also need an RE battery, which is more copper cables. We use so many copper cables and this is unreal. So that, copper cable, tin, redstone, RE battery. So I'll make the machine block now. Machine block, furnace, RE battery for the generator. Generator, electronic circuit, glass, and coal dust makes our very first solar panel. We have one solar panel. Yay. One. <laughs> one. We have one. 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 It's one. really not a lot of power. Um, we also need a bat box. So I'll make one of those real quick. So we can actually start collecting the power. Um, so that's three RE batteries, a copper cable, and some planks. We should be yeah. good to make those RE Yeah, I can see you're using the thing. Oh. <laughs> it's okay. We haven't got enough rubber at the moment anyway. We'll extract more now real quick before we sleep we could also do with a wrench at some point as well because that is how you remove the machines so we need bronze and to get bronze you smelt bronze dust and to get bronze dust mix copper and tin dust which you get through the macerator it is honestly really confusing it can be so confusing we'll also need i think it's two copper cables or is it one i don't remember i think it's one um, like this, surround it with planks, bat box, okay, so it's just the one. So I guess having a wrench is essential because if it's facing the wrong way, we won't be able to get any power from it. So we can just macerate one tin and two copper and that will give us two bronze dust. We need six. This is a case of just a waiting game though. It really is just a waiting game. <laughs> There's not much you can do while you're waiting for like things to macerate and whatnot. 
Um, but I will make more copper cables. And I'll also find somewhere to put the back box and solar panel. Um, I'm thinking of just having it outside. Just like here or something. Um, over time, we'll need. There's a, there's a creep. There is a creeper right there. It's not going to blow up our machines. <laughs> No! Okay, it only brought, blew up one block of the wall. It's fine. It's fine. I Creepers are just... God, they're annoying. They are annoying. It blew up <laughs> a little bit. A little it blew bit. up a little bit. Yeah, it only blew up part of the wall. Nothing on the inside was actually damaged. Um, we also lost a window, but that's not a problem. <laughs> we lost a window, Sean. Ugh. I not can't, a win again, <laughs> I can't leave you alone for five minutes. You die. <laughs> To a creeper, you blow I mean, up the house. This was entirely you last time. Look, this one, this one, this one, right? <laughs> Tell it was me not me I'm this wrong. time. Not me this time. Okay. The only reason is that I take all of the hits from the creepers for you because I know that you are. Sure, the, you do. Um. Listen. <laughs> okay, so our very temporary setup could be. We'll have the solar panel outside, which I've already placed. Um, I'll make it over there now. So the solar panel is here. We can have the back box here where the dirt block is, and a copper cable in between. Um, we can have the cables going at the back of the wall and power everything from here with the torches. Um, it shouldn't be that bad. Things should be all neatly arranged, all tidy. It could be very nice. So another thing we can make is a hand saw. Um, so they are very easy to make. They're just some sticks and some iron. Um, but we could also make coloured ones if we really wanted to. But there's not really much point. So sticks and iron make the iron hand saw. And we can also, well we can now throw in some wood, cut it, cut it a few times. And we've got these covers. Hello there, Sean. <laughs> Hello. How <laughs> you've returned. You've um, returned? I, yes, that's the obsidian. Thank you. I've put the diamonds in the chest already, the top one. Okay, maybe. thank you. I will show everyone the condenser in a second. I just want to get the power set up, so thank you. Okay, so now we have the tin dust and the copper dust. We can just put the tin there, split it up like that. We have all the bronze dust we need. Throw that in the furnace and it will smelt that bronze dust into bronze. We need six of that. We need six, which we do have, which is great. I do realize I'm like hopping all over the place in this video. I do apologize for that. <laughs> I can't seem to sit still. I'm constantly like switching around what we're doing. Um, I just, that's the thing with Tech It though, is that there is so much going on. There's always new things that you want to like show off. It is really fun. Um, anyone who's never played this before, I recommend you do. It is really fun. It's so easy to like download and set up. I've got like a very mini tutorial in the description on just how to get it if you really don't know. Um, it's super fun. Okay, so we have the copper cables, we have the wrench so we can move the stuff. So you can just right click on it with a wrench. And now we have an extractor. I can't talk, we have an extractor now. Um, the macerator sometimes turns into a machine block, but it didn't which is great. Um, the generator, I guess we can just collect it all. There's nothing else in there other than the bronze. And we have everything. Cool. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to chop out this panel of wood, I guess. Put a copper cable... Actually, I'll, put, I'll do the copper cable last. I'll put the bat box like facing down, I guess. Copper cable there, and that should be slowly charging up now. Cool. So, basically, what it's doing is the solar panel is collecting, you know, solar panel, solar power. I'm getting panel and power confused. <laughs> <laughs> and it's charging at the bat box. It's just a battery, pretty much. So, I'm going to move that here. So, the green side is the output side, which is, you know, where we need powering things from. So what we can do is have copper cables here, 
put machines in front of it. We could also just have like a row of copper cables just going along the top here. We could knock out the glass here and just not have a window in this section. So we could put in our macerator, extractor, and electric furnace just here. It's quite messy, but it's also quite clean at the same time. We can just have more machines above the cables because the cables are wiring into them and they are getting power just very slowly. So we need another way of powering the back box because quite frankly, one solar panel really isn't enough. <laughs> one solar panel is not that good at all. Sean's just vibing outside. So what we can do is because we still have the generator, I could put the generator here and then dig up this space stone here. We can tidy it up on the outside afterwards. Connect that, connect to this. This is a very messy way of doing it. We haven't got enough rubber, have we? We need one more piece of rubber. <laughs> uh, it's okay, I can get one piece from this. Um, powering it is, uh, we haven't got enough power. It's not gonna be enough, is it? It's not going to be enough. Emergency plan for the time being. We can just put the generator right next to it. And just put some coal in there. That'll give it the power it needs. It'll charge it up. So, um, uninsulated copper cable. One rubber. Copper cable. I'll put it there. Get the generator. Slap that there. So now it's, I guess it's tidier to an extent. So now if we put coal in there, it will charge up the generator a lot quicker than the solar panel did. So outside, you know, there is <laughs> where there was once wood. It's kind of a mess now. We can just put this on top, but we can cover it up. This is like vertical, sl vertical slabs, which is amazing. We have vertical slabs in this mod. So now we can do the same thing with stone bricks. Oh, does it not work with iron hand saws? Oh, we should have made a jet. The gem ones can cut it, but not iron ones. So we can cut this down even more to get the covers. And then we can just put them here. And you will never know there's a lot of cables behind. I mean, I could do it with the top bit as well. See what I mean, though? It is very nice. Don't you agree, Sean? It is very nice. It is so cool. It's a very nice, very useful mod. We now have like four rubber trees growing, by the Four? Way. That's good. Yeah. There we go. So one part of the house does look a bit thicker, but it's not really something you'd notice at first sight. So the bat box can store up to 40,000 units of whatever the power is. Um, the solar panel is very inefficient. Just the one. That's why we need loads. But we can make more at some point but I do want to show off the other things now so I put all this away and I will make our best friend you may think I'm very sad for saying that but when I show you what our best friend is I'm sure you will agree <laughs> as real dreamer as real dreamer <laughs> my god okay so the condenser well first off we need the alchemical chest which is covalence dust, all three types. So the first one is uh, eight cobblestone and one charcoal, specifically charcoal for some reason. So that's not a problem. We can just throw that in the electric furnace. We only need one piece because each one gives us 40. Plus we only need the one. Um, we also need one iron and one redstone, which we can do to get 40. The other one is one diamond and one coal. Our first use of a diamond is to make covalence dust. So the alchemical chest is a chest, two stone, the green, cyan, and blue covalence dusts. Uh, the, the chest goes there, I'm pretty sure. The diamond there, and I want to say iron there. Yeah, there we go. Alchemical chest. So this is pretty much just a chest with a lot of storage. That's all it is, really. It doesn't have many other uses other than that. It has a couple of small ones, but nothing too crazy. So we put that in there. 
we put four diamonds here and then four obsidian here and now we've got an energy condenser this is one of the best things ever so <laughs> how are we going to explain this well i mean i guess the best way is just to show it i guess do you have the diamonds i have diamonds yes okay well i'll get the nickelite i guess that's... oh yeah maybe we can show that off after i show off like a, a basic introduction then so oh, okay. the emc values underneath everything literally just shows how much everything is worth so a wooden plank is worth eight cobblestone is worth one so let's say we want to get some cobblestone we can put a cobblestone in here which is worth one and dirt which is also worth one because they're both worth the same they just get converted into each other pretty much um wooden planks is worth eight times as much as cobblestone so we'll make eight cobblestone diamonds is worth eight thousand one hundred ninety two of them so we're just putting it <laughs> I'm not putting in a diamond. The chest will be full of cobblestone and it takes a while to convert when there's loads. Um, but for bigger things, let's say iron. If we need a load of iron, we can put in a diamond and it makes 32, di 32 iron. It's very useful. So what Sean's going to do now, um, because there's stuff in here called Nicolite, um, it does have a use, but it's nothing that we're probably going to get into right now anyway. And the EMC does add up. So it's nice to turn it into diamonds. So if we put a diamond in there, if you throw in the nickelite, how much of it? All of it. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Well, there's okay. I'll <laughs> save one, but the rest. Okay, so we have three stacks and twenty-one of nickelite. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Wants to slowly <laughs> build up. It's converting them all into diamonds, which is great, because we need diamonds a lot more than we do with nickelite. Um. Mm -hmm. So there's 2,688 EMC left over. So if we take, actually, have you got any uranium? Uranium, we have three. Let's put the three in there then. Oh, all of them? Not the same yeah. one? I mean, we don't really use it. <laughs> oh, that's fair. Well, each one is worth 4,096. So, so half a one. diamond. There we go. So that made a diamond and a half. So we also have some redstone, which we need, but sticky resin. This is the good stuff. So there's 6,700 EMC left over. Not quite enough to make a diamond, so it's just stored in the chest. Sticky resin is worth 24. So put that in there. And we've now got four and a half stacks of sticky resin. <laughs> um, very, very useful. <laughs> yep. So we can now put some sticky resin in the extractor. Let's put in 16 for now, because we don't really have that much fuel. We being powered solely by coal at the moment. In the extractor, sticky resin doesn't get turned into one rubber. It gets turned into, if it does it, three. So that's good. It's a great source of rubber. <laughs> There's also four more uranium in there for some reason. So uh, don't mind me, but we're gonna make some more diamonds. <laughs> but yeah, energy condenser, one of the best things. It's so useful. It took me a while to actually understand it. It does I was get kind of confusing. About using it. I'm pretty much okay with it now. It's just like, you know, when you don't see all the energy stored in there and you put in something simple. Yeah, that does <laughs> like happen a lot. Um, it's easy to miss the number in there. So if you throw in like a piece of cobblestone, <laughs> that happens. Just, yeah, that's not what I'm scared of. But then, like, yeah, I mean, you can still convert it. Like, like let's, let's, yeah. we can now get infinite food putting in some bread so it's going to convert the cobblestone into bread it probably wouldn't taste very nice might be a bit crunchy yeah this is pebbles and a few pebbles mm. 